Sunshine. But tonight, baby, I got heaven on my mind. Heaven on my heart. 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 Oh, look at the mist coming off it. We are in business, people. Ah. What's up, guys? Liam here, and welcome back. Mm. Love the taste of White Monster in the morning. Welcome back to LSJ TV. I am here for my first trim. As you guys can see, my hair is a little bit out of control again. Um, I actually had the courtesy car last time I had my hair cut. That then disappeared, uh, and then I didn't have a car for another couple of weeks again. It's been about three weeks since I've had my hair cut, and that's a long time for me. There's people going, <laughs> three weeks? I'll get mine done every six weeks. <laughs> well done you, I like skin fades. I don't know what it is, but there's this thing between lads, and particularly in between, like, me and me and Jake, you know Jake, we both love skin fades, right? The one that's just gone to Ibiza, the one that got shredded for Ibiza and stuff. Our other mate, Alex, and Jason, in fact, are not bothered about getting their hair cut, right? But me and Jake are. And they're like, oh, I get my hair cut every six weeks. And they like brag about it. Like it's a, a really good thing that they don't have to go and get their hair cut. And like, I choose to go and get my hair cut. It's just, it's a thing between lads, I think. Let me know in the comment section, guys, if that is a thing for you. So I'm here outside Ted's Barbers Nottingham, the trusty Nottingham barbers that I drive to every single time. Can you see it? Can you see? Yeah, you can see it. They do my hair, do my hair, very, very nice. So I shall continue to come. As often as I like. And then afterwards, we are going to take a trip into Nottingham because we have not been here for a while. I'm going to take Bobby for a tour around the city, my favourite city, right? Because I used to go to university here. We'll get to that in a little while. Here is the before on the old hair, looking a bit of a state. And there we have it, people. Ted's Barber's Nottingham sorted me out as per usual. We are off into town now. That's my alarm for my ticket running out. I'm going to be your tour guide for the day. Welcome to LSJ TV's exclusive Nottingham tours. Free of charge. Although tips are accepted. Now, if you look to your left, ladies and gentlemen, you will see Nottingham Castle. A little further down the street, the Robin Hood statue known for a fantastic Pokemon Go hotspot back in the day. As we continue down the street, you can see what was my stomping ground in second year, Coach House. We hosted many pre-drinks, parties, and that was about it really because that's all we did in this place. And I loved every second of it. And we have the front door, the two windows that belong to the two very annoying boys that lived beneath us. This was Charlotte's bedroom. We have my bedroom. And last but not least, the kitchen. What a time to be alive. For our next stop, we have Upper Parliament Street, the most popular get on, get off stop for the number four bus, the one I used to take to Clifton Campus. As you may or may not know, Nottingham Trent is based on three campuses. Nobody cares! Wait, what? Shut up! Sh shut up. Stupid prick. Okay. Here we have Corner House, home to some sick bars, restaurants, and most importantly, Nando's. A cinema, crazy golf, this is really the place to be. And as we continue down the street, you can see on your left, City Campus, home of the SU where I spend every Saturday night, because I'm hard as f Seriously though, voted best SU in the country like 69 times. It's good in there. Moving right along, Chunky Chicken, everyone's favorite spot after a night out. A little further out of the city, we have Gordon House, my third year residence. Looking a little run down since I left, I must admit, but my bedroom is still going strong. I see they've made it permit parking at last. Where was that when I was there? Hey, I couldn't park my own car outside for f sake. Oh, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Touchy subject, I'm get getting a bit carried away there. Um, <clears throat> yeah, okay, moving on. Ladies and gentlemen, please collect your bags as for the next stop we'll be walking around the town for approximately 30 seconds. Market Square next, where every other person that you see will be a delivery driver, there's always something going on here. They're actually building a massive bar. This would usually be a beach, but for obvious reasons, people can't be sharing a paddling pool while having a drink right now. <laughs> Get on with it. Also home to Slug and Lettuce, St. James's Street, Beer Keller, and most importantly, Donuts. Now single file please, only two in the store at a time. 
Love You Babes is our next stop in the heart of the Victoria Centre, or Vic Centre, if you're down with the kids. This is where you will pick up the world's finest fancy dress, you know, for Ocean Wednesdays, obviously. If you would like to grab a quick burrito on your way back to the bus, I would recommend Tortilla. You just can't go wrong. It's downstairs in the Vic Centre. And that concludes our tour, everybody. Like I say, free of charge, but tips are accepted in the forms of likes and comments. Fueling my ego is payment enough. Thank you for using LSJ Tours, and we hope to see you again soon. £4.50! £4.50 for a friggin' large burrito with extra guacamole and a bottle of water! Game changer! As long as you go on a Monday, Tuesday, or Wednesday, I think. And today is Wednesday. You guys aren't seeing it on Wednesday, but today is Wednesday. £4.50! Madness! On a serious note, though, it is lovely, genuinely lovely, to see things going slightly more back to normal. I went to Nottingham maybe three, four weeks ago with Charlotte. You know when we went to get that burger? We went to get the Annie's Burger Shop burger. It was a freaking ghost town. It was an absolute... Like, the weather was... Well, it started raining actually, but for the most part, the weather was okay. You know, it was an absolute ghost town. I went and had my hair cut. There was already someone else in there having a haircut, which wasn't happening, which didn't happen last time. People were going in shops. I mean, everyone was wearing a mask, so it was still a little bit weird. But no, it, it was really, really nice to actually just just do something that felt a little bit more normal. You know, no one was being weird. People were just people just know how things work now. You know, to keep your distance a little bit, and it was nice. <laughs> it was good. Donuts acquired as well for the fam, so that's very, very nice. We're actually having a burger tonight, so I've had a burrito burger and I'm gonna have a donut today. Looks like we're gonna call this video another cheat day, but hey, we are way ahead of where we should be, so I'm gonna do it and I'm gonna enjoy it and I'm not gonna feel bad about it. The funny thing is I actually don't feel bad about it at all. There's 100% gonna be people watching this going, Liam, why are you eating all of this? You're dieting, but I will wake up soon within the next few days with a new low weigh-in. Watch me fam, watch me! I work hard up in here! Right, so I'm gonna drive home. Enjoy my, enjoy my ride in Bobby. And on with the day. Burrito, fueling me. Fueling me right nice for a leg session. I knew that I was gonna, you know, have a leg session. I was gonna burn a few more calories. I'm also gonna go for a walk later on today, probably a good hour's worth of a walk. So I'm not too worried about actually having the food that I'm gonna have today because I am upping my expenditure. Calories in versus calories out at the end of the day. Ignore all the salt and all of those other factors. Calories in versus calories out. It's how you keep it as simple as possible. But six sessions so far. Thank you all so much for the support on the My Protein video, on the videos, all that kind of stuff before that. The plan is every kind of three to four weeks, you know, I don't want to overdo it, but you know, I've also, I've got bills to pay, you know, this is, this is how I pay some of my bills, right? Getting angry at someone for promoting a product or something like that online is like getting angry at your favourite friggin' Premier League striker for scoring a goal, you know? That's how he pays the bills and that's how, it's kind of how I'm paying mine as well. So I will be doing it every few weeks, I don't want to overdo it. But just so you guys are aware, you know, take it with a pinch of salt and just enjoy the videos for what they are. Which is hopefully fantastic entertainment. this watermelon? Play away. Really been growing on me over the last few days. Really, really quite like it. I do love me a little bit of watermelon. Unfortunately though, I've got to find some space for it up here. I think I might have to have a, a little rearrange. Maybe do that in another video. But for now, just know, once this comes out, you're probably going to want to get your hands on some. I'm just saying. So, I'm actually going to sit down right now and edit the video that you are watching right now. I oh, know, right? Vlogception. I'm going to get a little bit of work done, got some emails to do um, and some negotiations to have. So that's great. And then we'll have dinner in a bit. 
please drop the video a like if you are enjoying it because you know if they go up and they get more the videos just do better it's as simple as that so if you are enjoying it so far and you know you're still here and you haven't liked or subscribed please do so i appreciate you Oh yeah! Da, 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 da. <laughs> oh my god! Oh yeah! Oh, check that! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. New low way in in three, two, one. Mm. Yes, I know it's on my face. I know I don't care. So, I have two options, people. Number one. I do a cheat day kind of video title, cheat meal kind of title, you know the one, you know, you see them all the time, right? You like them. That's option number one. Option number two is that I go for an ironic title of staying on track with my diet, obviously having a burrito and a burger and a massive friggin' donut. Those are my two options and I'm genuinely really struggling to decide. I'm going to have picked one and you're going to know the answer by now because you're going to see the title and hopefully you've watched like all 11 and a half minutes, 12 minutes of this video. If you have not already subscribed and you have made it to this point, please take the time to do so. Stick around here. We've got some interesting stuff. The next few months on the channel are going to be pretty damn exciting. The next few weeks, next few days are going to be exciting, let alone the next few months. Big things coming, people. I hate it when people say that. But anyway, one of the two titles, you guys will know by the time it comes live, by the time it is live. Let me know which of the two you would have chosen personally for yourself. You guys can become YouTube gurus in the comment section. I love my freaking comments, you know. I absolutely love the comments. You guys are all awesome. If you drop a comment, if you send me a message, whatever, you know who you are. I appreciate you. Much love. Together we all grow. So I hope you have enjoyed today's video, regardless of what the title winds up being. Like I say, you've got to take this social media stuff with a pinch of salt. I hope you have enjoyed the video, nevertheless. One more quick thing before I go, the clear way isolate watermelon, the cranberry one, and the mango and coconut one, that is all live right now. I'll put a link in the description box down below. My code will not work because my protein I like you to pay full price for clear way isolate. It's just one of the exempt items from the discount code. It's the same with every single one. It's a bit annoying, I know, but understand please that there is nothing that I can do about it. And I appreciate your support if you do still decide to use my link, because that will still directly help me out and you know, build my relationship with the company, which I'm hoping to progress very, very soon. I just need someone to trust me because I feel like, you know, that's a story for another time. Anyway, if you have not already, please do your boy a favor, drop the video a like, drop it a comment down below, subscribe if you are new. Let's start a favorite moments section in the comment section. What I'm gonna do for each video moving forwards is put what was your favorite moment and then you guys can reply in the comments with like a timing of your favorite moment of the video, whether it's a stupid singing thing, a burger or whatever. Let me know in the comment section and let's have a conversation. Let's get a chat going. I appreciate you all. Together we will grow. Thank you so much for your support and I will see you beautiful people. Come in closer with me. In the next one. Are you still there? If you're still here, I freaking love you. I'll see you in the next one. <laughs>